of any kind. Thanks for your public and private encouragement. This is Robert Forsh. My phone number is 1-843-544-1776. You can messenger me anytime on Facebook as well. Thank you so much. Job 37 in the Bible says that God's or that uh, the sun is in the midst of the clouds means it's very close. The earth is stationary according to scripture in many locations it says that. So the earth doesn't move and it's the sun and moon and stars that do. I have many occurrences of the sun appearing in the midst of the clouds on my YouTube channel, Truth. You can uh, reach out anytime you like. I did a brief little Instagram live, um, live feed. You can hashtag my name and YouTube Truth if you care to. Higher is drier and lower is wetter. We've got flooding all over. Um, I call it weather wars. Uh, weather modification is real. Modifying the uh, the weather and the gene pool with uh, genetic engineering of plants and people. They're adding biological content to the air we breathe as well. And look at that if you care to. I've got it on my YouTube channel, Truth. I talk about it. I show it. As in the days of Noah, so would it be when the Son of Man returns. Ultimately, I believe that Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. Good morning. Good to see you all. <laughs> Feel free to reach out anytime, like I say. The reason why I do that is... Um, a lot of us are getting beat up for not only believing, but uh, telling the truth about the world that we live in. So it, uh, that sense of uh, fellowship and relationship is uh, beneficial. I bathe in drinking water with a little baking soda in it. I've got a reverse osmosis system for uh, filling up my five gallon polycarbonate jugs. It's only a couple hundred dollars. And then um, I'm liquefying spinach, kale, chia seed, hemp hearts, broccoli, apple cider vinegar, mixed berries, bananas, any other fruits and vegetables I want to add. So the idea is to put healthy nutrients in, keep the toxicity out, what we uh, think about, what we look at, what we ruminate on also affects our physiology and our, our perspective. So a lot of this has to do with perspective. We're all eternal beings having a temporary human experience. At some point in the human experience, the child of God will absolutely be born again. That's for sure and that's forever. Where the sun and the moon appear and vanish on the horizon can't be explained by the spinning globe fly. Okay. This is the 50 year anniversary of the moon landing hoax. There's the moon right there. We didn't land on that. Never did. Uh, you can research NASA lies. I hashtag that a lot. 
And the reason being is because it's true that NASA does lie. Not always. An effective deception has a certain amount of uh, truth and factual information. Even today, on my the apps that I show, well, that's interesting, isn't it? You don't see that too often out on the beach. But there you go. Um, so we don't have people upside down in other parts of the world in relationship to us. An effective deception encompasses a certain amount of truth and then uh, a lot of uh, deception at varying levels. So the flooding that's happening around the world, it's happened in Australia, it's happening um, in the United States as well. You've got technology. The technology exists to create tsunamis, just so you know. I'm right at sea level, right here in Cherry Grove at the point. So if we had a tsunami come in here, that'd be it for me. <laughs> My uh, content would still be up to the cloud, apparently. AI, artificial intelligence, can um, selectively shut down the power grid wherever, whenever God allows. God who created this world. So I'm a biblical creationist and I proclaim the gospel. I've got a, um, an audio Bible merged with the beauty of creation. Much of it was recorded out here. I want to back this up a little bit and show you um, maybe you could hear the wind. Um, it's drying up a little bit. It was a uh, pretty heavy dew, low humidity, but a lot of wind in the last 24 hours uh, shaping the dunes that we have out here. You can see the wind blowing there. See the effects of the wind. We can't actually see the wind. Jesus uses the example of the Holy Spirit moving through humanity like the wind, giving life to his children. Thought I was born again over 35 years ago until I actually was roughly three or four and a half years ago on Reformation Day or Halloween as the blood drinking, human sacrificing Satanists celebrate. One of the evidences of my new life in Christ is being set free from a life of addiction. That's a big deal. So what I'm going to do is cut this broadcast right here, or the recording, and start another one.